Many thanks to Jeff Cruz for his Saturday Education on Air visualizing data with maps. If it wasn't for Jeff, I wouldn't be making this video. So to get started, this is to show you how to create a new map and outline a country and drag it and park it alongside another country. I'm showing you all the steps here. There we have a simple title, which is Iceland v Portugal, which looks like a football match. But what I'm going to do is this can get a, get a bit tricky and that's why I want to make this tutorial to make it simple and then I'll be asking a couple of questions at the end about what I cannot do especially the copy and the paste part rather than drag so for an example if you go and drag Iceland all the way to the Caribbean there's a lot of dragging and it gets very very tiny so what I'm going to do is add a line or a shape just to go on the outline so apologies to the population of Iceland while I literally butcher circumference here so all I'm doing as you'll see is it's putting some points in with those little white dots let's say that was done okay there we go I'm going to mark that as Iceland because that's the country and hit save now this is the part of the dragging where I think some people are getting a little bit stuck and what you'll notice is if I click away somewhere there are no points if I click in left mouse button down you see the whole map is moving and that's where some people are getting stuck so what we need to do is double click it first and I ignore the I'm just wheeling out my mouse there and ignore the the pop-up and then just go into the bottom uh, where my button is left mouse button and now I'm able to drag it now what you'll, you'll see about this and this is the thing where it gets a bit fiddly is I want to take it to Portugal which is not too far away but when I it's Portugal down here of course now you can notice that the more that I am zooming out the worse it's getting for me to drag it and it could get a bit fiddly because if I hit one of these white dots I'm going to drag the the whole shape um, differently so that would probably be okay and you'll notice that I can drag it down there that is kind of okay and that's all we want to achieve really so what I did is if I right click on here all I get is a delete button. Um, what I'd like to know is how I can, say, copy this shape and put it somewhere else. So you notice again, you see I've lost the ability to move or to drag the whole country. Click it once, and I've got to activate the, the shape itself. Let me just show you the main version of this, and Jeff did it brilliantly on Saturday, and that is that if I take, and this is the thing is, you've got the whole world in Iceland is, you know, in respects quite a small country, and so if I can just get in there, yes I can, and you'll notice if I take it to the equator, it's very, very tiny, you can see that we've got um, Guinea and Gabon, um, let's have a look at another one, Ecuador, that's a good example, you see it's quite small down here, you see and I've lost, um, I can just about get into the center is what I'm trying to do, then if I bring it up, the further I go north, zoom out a little bit, and this video is going to end, and I take it up to, there we go, if I placed it onto near the North Pole area, then it becomes bigger. So that's all I want to show you, and remember that I'm trying to drag now, nothing's happening. Click once, and then drag the shape, and that was how to do it. Have a brilliant amount of fun with that. I'm about to make this little uh, map here public so everybody can have a go with it. Please take a copy rather than edit it um, so others won't get stuck. Thank you.